set the stage. We're back. It's another steep drop down here. I tell you, man, it don't never look like it on when I'm watching this back on camera. Like it does in person. That's one thing this can. <coughs> <coughs> one thing for sure. This camera fails to get a good representation of. Getting late starting here today. It's about seven o'clock. I think I beat it by just a hair. Oh boy, look at that locust they ran onto there. Ooh, look at the thorns on that locust tree. Mm. Somebody went to fall in and grab that. And it might save them, but boy, they would pay for it if they caught some of them thorns in their palm of that hand. Now, mm. I still have amongst it. Guess I don't have enough thorns right here all the way on the end, thank goodness. It ain't too far down there though. They're on the branch. Wow. I was wrong. The water's still high. I predicted Friday that this water would be back down by Saturday evening. That's what I said. You know, if it didn't rain anymore. And I think it did rain a little bit, but it didn't, didn't make it to what I was talking about. Like, that would actually make it stay up I thought it was going to have to rain more I mean I don't think the rain the, the little bit that it rained I don't think it had anything to do with uh, I really didn't have nothing to do with it to tell you the truth with what the fact that it's still high is just that we got so much rain this week is the reason why this water's still up And we're back. Uh, three days in a row, man. That's the first for this season. That is a first. But that's it. Not for my lifetime. And so I fished right in here yesterday. Pretty rainbow. Come here, buddy. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, you got me in the tree here. Whew. Can't get my net. I'm doing whatever he wants to with me, y'all. <laughs> it's a comedy. I can't get my net for real. My net is gone. It must be falling off on me. Mm. There it is. Half stepping. My big daddy came out here all day long. Whew. Ooh, he stuck that hook in me. Yeah, he didn't want that. He didn't want that. That hook came out of me. I came in my finger and didn't went in the net. Went all the way through here. All right. That's a good start there, see? And right through it. Look at how the, he, he was hooked. Right in the top of his lip, but. Ooh, just by a thread, man. I mean, I could pull that. I could pull that out. Look, it fell out. Look at that pretty boat. Oh, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Now, that's what I'm talking about to start him off right there. 
I'm glad I came here. I, I, I started not to, I started to walk up to where I finished up yesterday. But the fact is, and this might be the fish that I missed. I missed the fish. I know I think I'm pretty sure it was a rainbow or a brook trout. Just it's probably that's probably that same fish. Because he was just in the hole just above here. And that's the reason why I came back. Because I, I think what happened was, if you watched the video from yesterday, this actually as of right now, it's not posted yet, but I will get it posted. Uh, what happened was he broke my line. Not that he's that big or anything. My hook, I had been having a hook issue uh, from the night before. And I hesitated to change it. It cost me a fish yesterday. I think I might have just got it back though. Uh, I saw him. I, I knew he was about 12 inches. And uh, like I said, I thought he was either a bush or a rainbow. And um, man, my net was all tangled up back here. Not a real way to be this creel. I'll tell you, man, my hat between between this this uh I don't understand it. I mean, an adjustment needs to be made kind of between this magnet on this net, this creel, and my hat, which has got a line. See that thing on my hat? Between them three things right there, you can get some tangle ups. And it happens every single time. 